Hey, you know one of the coolest things about the Offshore Tackle OR34 mini board? You don't need trolling gear to fish this. You can actually fish it with the same spinning gear you probably already own. Rods and reels just like this that you would apply to catch lots of things like crappie, walleye, bass, you name it. All I'm gonna do is just let the crankbait out the back of the boat to the desired distance, and that's about 10 foot right there. And a real good rule of thumb is if you just sweep the rod like that, that's about 10 foot of line. So now I've got 20 foot of line out. We've been catching these fish at about 30 foot back. So I'll sweep the rod a third time. Now I've got 30 foot of line out, close the bale. And at this point in time, all I need to do is reach down and grab my planer board. I'm gonna reach up and grab my fishing line. And I'm just gonna spin it a few times around my finger to make some loops. What I'm doing is I'm gonna take the front planer board release, the OR10 here, and I'm gonna put the line as deep into the pad as I possibly can. Now on the back of this board, I've added a red release, the OR16 snap weight release. And what I'm gonna do is put the line all the way behind the pin. This red release in the back has a pin in it. And what that's gonna do, when I get a bite and this board starts pulling back and I pull on my line, it's gonna release from the front, but the board's still gonna be held on the line by the OR16. That way I can reel the board and the fish in together. The other advantage of this is that I can put two or three or even four boards out to the side if I want to, and I don't have to clear lines in order to reel in fish. So this is an ingenious rigging method that works really well. I'll go ahead and just make some curly cues here. Put her back on there. Now when I've got it at this point, it's time to put it in the water. So all I'm gonna do here is open my bale, and I'm just gonna gently swing it out and let line off the reel. And as I troll forward, that old board is just gonna work itself out to the side. Go a little bit further here. That's about where I want it. I'm gonna close the bale, and then all I have to do is just put my rod down in a rod holder. And you can see that I've got a series of three rod holders here that allow me to fish three boards on this side of the boat.